All right, hey guys, um, welcome to the tutorial for my card trick that I came up with called uh, Quick Change. So, um, oh, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. Okay, for this card trick, you're going to need five cards. You're going to need three Redback Aces. These three right here. Um, one blue backed ace. I usually use the ace of spades and on the other three aces, as you can see. And then an indifferent red backed card that does not matter. The setup is you want to take your blue backed ace and your indifferent card and put them um, put the ace right on top of it if you're looking add them face up and then you want to put two aces on top of those cards and one ace on the bottom and you're all set doesn't matter which aces uh, the uh, one, one part of the trick will turn out different but otherwise it won't matter um, okay so now what you do is you start off by showing that you have four red cards you do that by doing an Escanio spread to do an Escanio spread it's really easy you hold it in the biddle grip just like this you pull top card off with your thumb and you pull the bottom card off with your index finger and then the next bottom card off with your middle finger so it looks like this from the top and you're only showing the top you're not showing the bottom if you were to show the bottom well you wouldn't see much anyways yeah, you wouldn't see much anyways so but you only show the top you can let go and hold it just like that and show that you have four red cards and you turn it over and you do an Elmsley count. Now, I'm not going to show you how to do an Elmsley count because I suck at teaching. Um, I will post a link either in the video or in the description um, for Miss Meg 822's one of, one of his Elmsley count tutorials. You're going to have to practice it. But um, anyways, basically, it's just that. You want to be kind of discreet about the top card because they're going to be seeing it twice. You want to pull it off, put it underneath everything push off all the cards and then bring it bring both the two back up like I'm not good at explaining things so just watch Miss Meg 822's video he's really good at it um, I'm not so good at it anyways a status check here you have your aces right here you have your indifferent card on the bottom your blue ace right next to that so now um, you just want to turn it over and do whatever you want snaps shake Wave your hand over it, you know, and then you want to do another Scania spread. Remember, top card off. I don't know if you could see this. I don't know if I was holding it right. With your thumb, index finger, bottom card, and then middle finger, just like that. Hope that. I hope you can see that. It looks like this from the top. See, oh, we have one blue card. Pull off. You should have two cards in this hand. See, two cards. Pull it off and you show the card that is underneath this so they think it's blue. You square up these cards in the sand and you show we have the Ace of Diamonds. And then you put it on top, give it snaps or shakes, you know, whatever you want. Turn it over and it's now the Ace of Spades. Now while you show the Ace of Spades, you want to get a small pinky break under the uh, bottom card, just like that. And you say we're going to take this blue ace of spades put it right on the bottom slide it in there and in, and you say you're gonna put it on the bottom but what you do is you actually put it underneath that pinky break right there but you say you're putting it on the bottom of the deck now you do your last set of snaps and you do another Elmsley count again link will be in the description or in the video somewhere and you say you have four red cards. You, now you can count off your four red cards. You can go one, two, three, four. Not revealing that there's another card under there. And now, the way you have it, you can say, now, and to know you're not cheating, you pull them off like this, and you do your last Scanio spread. And you show that you have four aces. And that's it. That's my um, card trick quick change. Hope you liked it. This card does not matter because it doesn't matter what the value is because it uh, 
you, they never see this card. They never see the value of this card. They only see the back of it. Otherwise, remember, I like to use the Ace of Spades for the blue card just because it sticks out. You know, so, um, yeah. See you guys later. Bye-bye.